bags here. We got the 12 by 12 by 12 Exoterra Nano, what is it, mini wide. We're putting Canthus Furia Geniculata spider legs in this. And uh, let's just start doing it. spot for her to go into. You can't see inside the tunnel without without me being in the way, but yeah. Perfect. There we go. My first ever full bio dude build. So I Need to get the paintbrush out. <laughs> All right, guys. Next up with the rehousing. Catch you then. All right, guys. Here is my Campus Korea Geniculata. This is Spider Legs. And I hope I can get her into this. Come on. And come on. Sorry about my arm, guys. All right, there we go. Spider legs. You can't the scurry of Janiculata. She is a pretty good sized beast, isn't she? Look at that. Now she gets to go into her new home. So let's see if we can get her in there. Just angle it out like this. Okay. Already getting, uh, she's already kicking her hairs into the hide. Yep. You just molted, you looked beautiful, and now you gotta go kicking hairs, huh? No, stop kicking, please. Just go down. I appreciate you going down, but you don't need to kick. Well, there you go. You just made your butt look ugly. <laughs> All right. You can't the screw your gen Nikulata. This is spider legs. Let's see if we can't get a, uh, a door view of her. There we go. Inside the new uh, what, mansion, castle, whatever you feel like calling it for her. Inside of her new dome. Her new 
biodome. And the last but not least, there we go. Oh, where is she at? There she is. This is actually the smoothest rehousing I've ever done. Even with such a large species. There she is. Now we shall just... Ooh, that is pretty bright. Hopefully these plants are like that. They should. Kick it at an angle like that. It won't be so bright. But Alright guys, thanks for watching. Peace and happy keeping.